Hi, I'm Andrew with Ether Automation. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to link products and deals using the built in um, related list, built in linking module in Zoho CRM using Deluge. Now, you remember, you, you may have seen a previous video where I linked two records using a multi select lookup. Now, I'm going to, the thing's going to pop out here if you want to see that video. In theory, this would work the same way, but it doesn't. Uh, and I'm, I'm gonna show you, show you why. So let me just share my screen here. And I hope it's the right screen. Okay, so as you can see here, I have a deal. And on the left-hand side, there's this um, module uh, related list called a product. So let's go down to that. So we can add a product, okay? That makes sense. Within a product, if I open up the product, there's the same thing on the other end where I can go down and I can add a deal. So much like other multi-select lookup um, fields, you'd think there'd be a linking record between them. But if I control F and I type in deals, uh, there's this one, there's the one on the left, and then the one on the bottom, right? And on the other end, if I control F for products, Right, we have a product one, two, three, and four. So there's no actual fields that link them, which means there's actually no linking module. So you can't create a record to link them. But I know they can be linked because I can go ahead and link the product in there. So if I go to the product, now the hamster product, it links to the deal. So how do you deal with this? Well, we can start by looking at the API, right? And I go to deals, right? Um, scroll down, look, there's still no products, right? There's just the one up here, right? Maybe you could check related lists, um, products. And there is the product one, but it's still not the linking module, right? I can also check here, so then, you might do what I suggested in the previous video. So let's go um, linking module missing. Standalone. So you might do what I did in the previous video where I go to create a record, zoho.crm.create record, and then look down the list. There's actually no, like down when we go to, so there's contacts as accounts, Event demos X contacts. There's no, there's no deals X products. So there is one way to do this. There's only one way, and I don't like it, but it, it is the thing. So let's go um, info. Actually, let's architect this out. So let's say um, gets deal and product ID. Link deal and product. Cool. So deal ID equals, and we'll use this one. This product ID equals, and then we want to use portal supplies right here. Equals that. And then let's go info zoho.crm. Dots and then you're not never gonna believe this, but you need to update a record that doesn't exist exist yet. So update related record, right? The relation name um, we'll say is deals. Then and then this one is products. So the parent module is the product, right? And the sub module is the deal. Product, product. Deal and
There we go. So it gives me an ID for some reason, which I don't know why it would ever give me an ID. But now if I go to here, go down to products, see there's hamster. If I refresh, there are now two products. And I can go to portal supply and you'll see that it's now linked. And if I go to the timeline, there's nothing in the timeline. There's no reason for these to be linked. It doesn't help anyone. So I learned this today. And so I wanna make a quick video to show you in case you watched my previous video and didn't know why this, this, there was no linking module. I hope this was helpful.